The Opel Blitz was manufactured in 1930 by the Opel company. It was designed as a commercial truck that was originally designed to carry 1.5 to 2 tons of cargo. Later on, at the end of 1936, it was upgraded to have a capacity of carrying 3 tons. As the truck itself was never designed for it to be used for the German army, but it did have all the specifications required by the German army. By the start of 1940, the Opel company started to produce a four-wheel version of the truck for better mobility, such as the Russian front as well as the desert of North Africa. The truck was reliable and easy to repair, especially with its traction system that was introduced in 1935 that helped with its off-road capabilities, such as navigating rough terrain. The production of the Opel Blitz continued manufacturing all the way till 1944 due to the destruction of the factory by the Allies' bombing campaign. About 82,000 Opel Blitz were manufactured alongside its basic model. And there was about 140 different designs during the course of the war, such as communication vehicle, fuel truck, medical truck, as well as an anti-aircraft truck. There was even a half-track variety. Despite it being originally a civilian truck, which was modified for the military, it was a capable vehicle that was perfectly suited for the German army. And until 1954, it was still being manufactured under license by Daimler-Benz, for civilian uses, obviously. And that is a brief summary of the Opel Blitz. Additional bonus, the Opel Blitz used gasoline, which was an advantage at the time as diesel was hard to come by. Till next time.